But I do say that I have many conservative values that I will talk to you about. And so if you look at your network you that you're Republican? standing behind, yes, and when you look at your network that you're standing behind, you're saying that you look at Chris Cuomo. I feel like that's an oxymoron, a black Republican. You feel oh, like it's an oxymoron? I do. Why? Your friend right here is a Republican. We had She's this conversation. Tell, tell me you do. You say you feel like it's an oxymoron that you're Catholic, but you also are pro-life. I, I don't understand either. No, you, you don't understand yourself then. You have, you have disagreements. I understand that, myself. I don't understand I, either of this, But it's not a personal conversation. Yeah. We're going, I don't, like, we're, I we're don't. having a personal conversation about, about CNN I, I don't and how black things can get leaked. And I don't understand Latino Republicans. Well, here's what I hear. But we hear that Twitter is not the real world. And in fact, on Twitter, it is predominantly straight white men. So when Elon Musk says, wow, this is about free speech, it seems to me that it's about free speech of straight white men. The Republican Party has moved further to the right than Democrats have to the left. There's a Pew Research um, Center analysis that finds that on average, Democrats and Republicans are farther apart ideologically today than at any time in the past 50 years. And that ideological divide breaks down to the Republican Party being an extremist party. And this, the Democratic Party actually, as you just mentioned, Sarah, moving more to the center. But isn't the Democrats sort of do this over and over and over again, right? They get into power, and then they sort they of lean the to, they save the country, then they lean to the middle and they, they put up, up agendas that sort of are supposed to not necessarily help the communities that put them into power, but instead help the communities that well, they didn't really put them the into community. power. They used and to. And then they lose they power. They used to. They know that the that was not my has my face. Back. That was an homage. Oh, please. The black Just community the has question. my back The black as community well. has your back? The black yes. community has yes, your back. They do. Sonny, the yes. black community well, did Sonny not vote them. for you. Well, the black you community know what? did not vote for you. What it was during are you a special election. On? Sonny, can I speak? What planet was during, are you living on? It was during a special wow. election wow. while we were exactly. still under lockdown wow. and I could not wow. talk to people. Can I speak, or are you just going to scream over me? This becomes a big... Listen, Kim, good luck to you. Thanks to Kim Close. That was very we'll immature, right but Bye. thank you for having me. You know, you feel that we need these two parties, and this party is obviously so broken. What is the answer now? What is the answer? Look, I, I, I think the answer is for, uh, for people who are sane Republicans who put country over cult and over the personality of Donald Trump to stay in the party and to keep fighting from, uh, from the inside out. The problem is... Too, out of every know, single Sonny, house member. One of the problems is that almost all the same Republicans have either lost generals, lost primaries, retired, or died. So yeah. isn't it a lost party? No. I, we can't, we, it can't be a lost it's party. It's not a this lost is not, party. This is not Cuba. We're not going to have a one-party yeah. system.